Craig, a true victory over Stockshire yep. Sports Steelers. What were your thoughts on that performance? Uh, I'm pleased for them. I'm pleased for the boys because I think they've took, you know, a bit of criticism uh, in themselves, rightly so, from from Chooser's performance. So I'm glad that you know the main thing today by hook or crook, you know, we had to get three points, and uh, you know I'm, I'm pleased for them. I'm pleased for them for for that. Uh, not the perfect performance, but better, more like what we're trying to do, uh, and the lads implemented it really well. I was saying periods where. Um, the game went a bit more flat, the other side took more of the possession uh, like we were seeing in pre-season, is yeah. that something that pleased you? Yeah, definitely, yeah, we've obviously, it's, it's well it didn't start well, we obviously, another injury in, in, in what or you know, breaking down in, in thing, it's, it just seems like Lady Love in, in with us on, on injuries at a minute in time, so, but I think where we played is, is yeah, exactly, we, we reverted back to, to how we played our way through pre-season because we had the personnel to be able to do that. Uh, and you know, I thought we, we played well. I thought you know there's some good performance in there that got on the ball, played past it, and we created a lot of chances. Uh, not perfect, you know, not perfect, but better, more promising, and, and I feel a step in the right direction. After Tuesday night's performance, how needed do you think this was? Oh, definitely, it's un unbelievably needed. Um, it's it's let's not get carried away. It's only three points, but you know, it's going to be a lot. Season, plenty of ups and downs, and I'm probably going to be stood in front of you, you know, really down in dumps, and I'm probably going to be stood in front of you like I feel now, you know, you know, really, really happy on top of the world, really thing. But we can't lose the fact that it's only three points, and and uh, and it will more improve performance than 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 the lads for Tuesday. And I'm, what I'm more pleased about is I know I keep saying this, and I say it many times, there are a good set of lads in there, a really good set of lads, and most pleasing thing is that they've reacted, you know, they aren't they aren't gone into the shells, they haven't, you know, been negative, they've come out the shells, they've gone on the ball, they've tried playing, playing in the right areas and uh, and, 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 and they've got themselves a reaction. And one player in particular uh, scored two goals today, uh, yeah. Liam Hardy, yeah. um, we saw a glimpse of it on Tuesday night in terms of his yeah. movement, but today we saw it come off, uh, what were your thoughts on his performance? <laughs> Great, but you get, yeah. as I said, you get, what you, you get what's on the tin, don't you? You get goals. Uh, I think he'll probably admit himself that he's probably disappointed he hasn't got three or four. Uh, you know, but, you know, he, he will, he, it's a good performance. Look, he's a, proper, he's a proper striker in a proper position. He finds himself in them positions. Uh, and you know what, as well, working with him closely in these last two di games, not just these goals what you get he, he actually works very hard for the side you actually don't realize how hard he works and and what he puts in in games so yeah it's a good performance from him and i suppose it's something that's needed when you've got a number nine that's uh, able to bring people in there um, and suppose uh, also his experience as well can help the other strikers at the club yeah definitely yeah i think we've got a rare different personnel in there at the minute in time uh, i don't think we're by all means the finished product we've still got a lot of lads again on the sidelines that we want to try and get back in uh, we are patched up in certain areas, but he's he's definitely affecting uh, you know people around him. And what what I think what what my reaction is to people is that I think when you bring someone so prolific that, that that's performed at a high level and you see the standards, it, it should drive other people round round them and the squad round them and give them a lift and said you know what I actually want to be part of this. I want to actually you know play with these players and hopefully it improves them just by. You know, watching him, what he does, and and, and, and sticking his name on, on on the score sheet. Three points today. How important is it to try and turn uh, it into six and keep that consistency going? Yeah, it's it's you know, look, I think we've all got to keep level headed here. You know, I think it's going to be a long season. You know, the top two at the minute are flying, uh, but you know, there's there's plenty of places up for grabs up there. Uh, we're early in the season. You know, we're in the we're in the right area. We're in there. We fight. Uh, and we've got to keep putting runs together and if, if that's six points out of nine every three games we have to work it that way I did mention that the other day you know you know it's 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 going to be you know a league where where you've got to you, you know two back-to-back -back three points pushes you might push you up five six places it might cement you in a place in the playoffs it might you know put you in touch and with the top two so yes it's so important that we do put little little runs together but I think we've got to keep a level headed as well and think do you know what you know, we've got to keep playing these little mini, little mini leagues and keep claiming as many points as we can, but don't get too down when, you know, we, 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 it don't go right for us. But the same token, you know, let's not, you know, let's not get carried away and think we're the, we're the end product and, you know, we, we're this down the other when we, when we pick up three points. We, we don't.
with that in mind then uh, Brighouse on Saturday you know, a team that you've faced many occasions and yeah. a couple of good battles with uh, yeah. what are your thoughts going into that performance and uh, what do you think they'll bring uh, I, yeah I think I think they're a good side I think they'll they're, again they're in that, that mini league as I keep talking about uh, and obviously they're, they're on their own patch so they're obviously going to come and and take the game to us so you know it's interesting for us we've got to turn up we've got to believe in what we do play like we did today create chances and hopefully create chances score chances and hopefully that you know we can come away with three points it's going to be a good game interesting game I think against two sides that are probably level out at the minute in time in, in where we are so it's, a, it's, it's an exciting game but before that Sheffield Senior Cup against uh, Ecclesfield Red Roses I've just remembered uh, what are your thoughts going into that? Uh, I think I think it's a game where you know we we want to do really well in in, in the cup. Uh, I do realise you know I get told pretty often uh, here that it's a cup that the club desperately want. You know I think there's a bit of pride in it, and I think there's a bit of rivalry between other clubs in you know who's winning, winning this, that, and the other. And yeah, so we're taking it seriously, and we'll be turning up with a very strong side, hoping to to win the game and, and put ourselves into the next round. We're not taking anyone lightly. And, uh, and 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 mark my words, we'll be as strong as we possibly can to to uh, to win that game.